good morning, good morning. It's your buddy Mikey here, SD Fish and Sips. I'm back on the solo skip. It is Tuesday, September 26th, 2023, and there's still fish offshore within striking distance on the solo skip. So hopefully the weather cooperates today, and I'm gonna be trolling is the main name of the game today. Troll hard, you know how it goes. I got the Abbott 30 wide on the Seeker, black steel rod, the roller rod, and I'm starting off with this Alco Max, purple and black. My buddy Ben, Bentino, shout out to Ben. I was talking to him last night. He's been getting out there fishing hard, and they've been having luck trolling an Alco like this. So I got my Mad Max also, Cedar plugs, and everything else ready to go, and we're gonna send it. See what we can make happen offshore fishing here in September. And then I saw the lobster boat coming through this morning and setting up at Ski Beach. So lobster season starts on Friday. I'm gonna probably be back out here at Mission Bay. There's a concert going on that they're setting up for, I think, over here that they're gonna have this coming up weekend. And just fishing hard, fishing a lot. I was uh, on the sport boats on Sunday a couple days ago on the Mission Bell. I'll flash the card for that video. Got some yellowfin tuna that way. And the setups I'm going with today, like I'm saying, I got my trolling set up. I got the jig stick, the Avid LX right there on the Therese rod. And then I'll probably have this as a smaller jig stick. Ghost Paw, maybe, Cold Sniper. But thank you all for watching and following along and all the love and support. I'm feeling it big time. Thank you so much. I wouldn't be here if it wasn't for all of you awesome people. I really am truly living my dreams. I'm a creator just like we all are. You know, we're all in this together, trying to just live a happy life. Fishing makes me happy, being out on the water makes me happy, and seeing all you people make me happy. Life is beautiful. So if you haven't already, smash that subscribe, pound that like, check out channel memberships, check out my Amazon storefront, buy something through the links, my affiliate link, Sword Filet Knives. Uh, go into Squid Co, tell Joey or the people that you sent there, uh, you know, Mikey, that you watch my videos, use the code Mikey at Squid Co to get a discount. Um, and you know, and or buy better yet, buy a solo skiff uh, for me. Email me California solo uh, California skiffs at gmail.com and pick yourself up solo skiff so you can be living this dream and fishing as much as possible. That's the main thing that I love the most is the freedom that it's given me to just get out here on my own and go fishing. So it looks like we got Dave. I think this is Dave up here who bought a solo skiff off of me, and this is his maiden voyage on it. So go take a look at him, how he's got it rigged out, and then we're gonna head offshore. I'm gonna go straight west out of Mission Bay, see what I can make happen on the troll. Yellowfin tuna, bluefin tuna, Dorado, Mako shark, caught a Mako shark with Nom. Oh, here we go, solo skip fishing in September. We're coming to the end of September now. Man, time is flying. So like, you know, I got lobster season coming up and then maybe another trip up to NorCal where I got the tuna there last year. Try to, try to get that going. Fishing off the boats more with different people and then eventually make my way down to, hopefully down to Baja. Progress my skills down in Baja doing the same thing down there, and then get a boat, boat, get a boat, a mothership, take my show on the road worldwide. Love it, life. find Dave somewhere else. I got my radio on 72 here. 
and Glenn said he's gonna be on 68. We got homeboy here. He wants to talk. What's up, bro? Straight west, as far as I can make it. You, how far off the coast north did you get? Uh, you know where you got that tuna the other day? Yeah. Spot. Yeah, yeah. I went that far. To, uh, okay. So just just by the, uh, lake. Yep, yeah, 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 yeah. So, uh, I didn't see anything. You didn't see anything? Uh, no, I hardly saw any boats. What's that? I saw hardly any boats. I know, the fleet's not out there. That's why they're further west. Yeah, let's see how far I can make it. How far do you get? I, th I think that they're closer to the rig. Like, I think they're between like around 20, maybe 15 to 20 miles. I don't know. It, it, it seems like, I don't, yeah, we'll see. My plan is just to set head straight west as far as I can make it and then start making my, there's a high tide, what, at 8.30? Yeah. But you're pretty brave, Nick. Right on, what's your name? Randy. Randy, and then you can be on the radio? 72, my buddy's gonna be on 68. Right on, Randy, yeah, no, that's what I think. You never know, they could be in that area, you just gotta get lucky, just have faith, and you're out here trolling hard, so. The exactly, that's what we are, right on, love it. We got Randy in the house. He said he was out here yesterday. La Jolla Canyon, never saw anything. to the 178, there's the 182. Punch the 182, we're out. 182. Navigate to. Go to 25 miles. Two hours. Could be there by nine if I just smash fast. Full speed, send it. I can put out the troller. over the nine mile bank or get closer to the nine when I put the controller out. Until then, control our earth. Enjoy the ride. Sunrise. Okay, it's been about 20 minutes or so. And I'm gonna be going across. This is the 270 area, so go ahead and put the troller out and then you know troll across this ridge on my way to the upper nine and then out west to the 182 so i'm gonna go ahead and take my man or my halco is this purple 
with black stripe, Halco Max. It's like the size of a Mad Max, the smallest one, 130. Keep it clipped off. And I got my Hobie rod holder right here on my Hobie H rail. I'm gonna go ahead, put that in there and then the gimbal locks it in. There's the lure swimming in the water. You can see it has similar movement, kind of like the Mad Mac, the side to side swivel. Let me go back. braided line bank that's the north nine right there where's 178 no north nine mile bank is even further south still got 14 miles to go i don't know if i'm gonna make it all the way out there it's already 8 30 but i'm gonna keep fishing and trolling and call it come across a couple pods of dolphins that I've trolled through. But I've had a lot of kelp on my lure, so you gotta keep an eye on that. Keep an eye out for the light. Let's go, troll hard. Doing about, I don't know, 10 to 12 miles an hour. Long trolling. Got a 
ride these waves smartly, how I maneuver across these waves determines how badly I get beat up and how wet I get. It's about nine o'clock in the morning now, about 15 miles from Mission Bay and 10 miles from the 182. And there's some boats. I see three or four boats out here fishing. Keep my eye out for dolphins, birds, foamers, freezers, boilers, body jumpers. The sunglasses on. All right, good to go. Okay, we got a fleet of boats up here. Sport boats, looks like there's three of them. Some private boats, got another boat trolling through here. I'm gonna check my trolling lure, make sure there's no kelp and then troll. See? out here by Sea Watch. I've seen a couple fish busting. They're here. Try to hook them on the troll. Unless I want to start jigging. No one's really hooked up. Switch up to the DTX minnow. We'll see. 
Looks like this is some sort of a bait boat. I don't know what they're fishing. And then I am six and a half miles away from the 182. It is almost 10 a.m. Not too bad out here conditions wise, pretty nice. 10.30 and I'm two miles away from the 182, so 23 miles from shore. There's some bird, I saw a couple birds starting to work and then there's like three boats in the distance. So I'm gonna continue, I still got the Halco out. If I don't get bit, I'm gonna switch it up to the DTX, Nomad DTX Minnow. But right now I'm gonna keep trolling this Halco. Come on, baby, let's get bit. At least see something. Hope I can see some dolphins. Was fishing by the sea watch for a little bit. Looked fishy, but I didn't see any fish. No hookup. Let's see what these boats are fishing up here. Okay, it's 10:45, and I'm one one mile away from the 182 made it out here into the zone 25 miles from san diego mission bay out here on the solo skiff that's what it's all about so now we're gonna go ahead and look for something going on Let's go to the 182 troll around this area try to find some dolphins or some foaming fish This boat's cruising by, they're trolling a spreader bar, it looks like just one spreader bar, you can see it splashing right there. And I'm pretty much on the 182 now. We're gonna get a troll. Keep trolling the Halco, then switch it up eventually. You know, 140 or maybe a Mad Max, we'll see. I didn't bring my little spreader bar. I'm not seeing any dolphins, no birds. No foamers, no boils. Just a big, big ship, container ship. All right, troll hard. Next up here, we got this big tanker ship. And then there's two other fishing boats here. I still got the Halco out. Not seeing very many dolphins or birds on the outside here. It's pretty dead, but I'm gonna continue to fish. I made it this far. Might as well keep trolling. Thought I saw some fish or dolphin, but I think it was just the wake of this boat. Oh, there's a bird. Like that though, maybe they're just chummy. done 34.3 miles four hours 42 minutes so far go back my way back hopefully I get lucky 1122 right now at least two hours to get back probably closer to three get back between two and three all good troll hard way back in let's get them okay it is time to switch out my trolling lure. I'm gonna take off this Halco here. And I'm gonna tie on Bubblegum Pink Mad Max. 
Nomad Mad Max 200 hot pink. Changed out the treble hook. Control this max speed. I'm able. I'm going with the wind now and the swell. So I'll be able to control this thing fast. 13, 14 miles an hour. Seven turns. San Diego jam knot. That's how I tie. I got a 100 pound leader, 100 pound mono. I'm getting a lot of kelp on my palco. So hopefully. Mad Max does better. the 178 now and we got a buoy right here I think it's a weather buoy of some sort and just have not seen very much out here at all today early on those dolphins and then birds by the sea watch went out all the way to the 182 it was dead out there I didn't see much so hope we get lucky after the 178 right here then i'm going to go to the north nine and then loop back in all right let's get lucky got a couple blackbirds right here they've been tipping down towards the water now we're almost at the 50 fathom ridge line which is about six miles from mission bay that's why it's showing i'm 19 miles from the 182 where i left i saw that it looked like the new seaforth maybe uh the whale watching boat is going out but i'm not gonna go it's too rough going into the wind that way i'm just gonna keep making my way east back to the landing maybe you'll get lucky on the ridge line here i'll try to dip as much as i can north and then follow the ridge down south but it looks like right now i'm set to just go straight back dang i thought i just saw a foamer i think it was just a splash from the wind and the water and the waves i'm right over the 50 fathom curve line though Oh wait, what is that shining? That was a mole, I think. Something right up here. Shining. What is that? Is that a mola? Swimming on its side? Look at that. Usually I see them upright.
sun in. That's why it's sunfish. back at the jetty so I'm gonna go ahead and bring it in 50 feet of water That's going to do it for today's adventures. Sending it offshore 25 miles from Mission Bay to the 182. Searching for tuna and Dorado. Never came across them. Saw some dolphins at the 50 fathom ridge line. And then in between 178 and 182, about seven miles shy of the 182, the Sea Watch was out there fishing. They had the birds going with the chum. I trolled, I was trolling the purple halco, bunch through them. No bites, I didn't see anybody hooking up. And then I made my way out to the 182 and I didn't see nothing out there. No signs of life, hardly any birds or anything. No dolphins, big tanker cruise ship came by or a big tanker ship came by, cargo ship. And then I made my way back and put on the Mad Max, the pink one, and just trolled that. So thank you all for watching, following along. I'm blessed to be out here fishing. That's my favorite thing to do. I'm out here going hard. Taking advantage because the season's gonna end pretty soon. I don't want it to, but that's what's gonna happen probably the end of October, November. I'll see. But thank you, thank you, thank you. It's a beautiful world that we're living in. Living the dream. One love. Woo! final results seven hours 57 minutes and almost 60 miles solo skip doing work pushing it to limits 25 miles offshore loving it